so many unique dining experiences in downtown Naperville. I'm at one of them right now. Allegory on Main Street. I'm Danielle Tofano with the Downtown Naperville Alliance. Hi, Chris. We're in downtown Naperville on South Main Street at Allegory. Chris Mason is the owner. Thanks, Thanks for, for coming. Thanks for being here. And, you know, when you go to a lot of restaurants, um, you have your tried and true favorites on the menu. But I noticed with Allegory, things come and things go. Is there a reason behind that? Well, we're in Illinois, so not everything grows year round. Mm -hmm. So I'm limited by our seasonality and where we're at geographically. In the springtime, when things are in season in the spring, which is gonna be like cold leafy greens and mm -hmm. spinaches and stuff like that, asparagus, of course. That's what we're gonna be focused on. This one has been around a little bit longer than most dishes because people love it. What uh, is this? this is my Reuben, my friend Reuben. I knew who, I knew what it was <laughs> yeah. as it was set down. I knew what it was when it was back there because I could smell it, my favorite dish on your menu. Thank you very much. I'd like to think that it's the best Reuben in the world. I would put that in a competition against anybody's Reuben. It's really hard to concentrate with the sitting in front of me, but let's talk. We talked a little bit about local. Your story behind your greens and where you source them from. Let's talk about that. My microgreens, uh, that's the best version ever. I have a number of vendors in the area that source microgreens and grow them, but actually my general manager's mom uh, grows them for us. I love that. Which is great because she only needs like two weeks heads up and I can ask her for any microgreen I want. Yeah, so if you need something specific, you just you have that relationship with her. And it's very nimble. <laughs> I'm sure. Why do you think um, Naperville needed something like Allegory? Uh, who doesn't? <laughs> I, I mean, uh, I'd like to think that we're a great spot for people to come casual. Our food changes often. Uh, I'm the only chef owned farm to table restaurant in Naperville. Mm -hmm. uh, so that gives me a pretty unique edge and I can change my menu at will. Yeah, I love it. What's this that's sitting in front of me? This looks uh, delicious. Yeah, that's the shrimp and grits. Uh, I've been threatened by a number of people to never take that one off the menu. <laughs> uh, I think you included. Yeah. Uh, this is uh, my take on a Southern shrimp and grits. They're black and shrimp and uh, the grits are really cheesy, really, really cheesy. Yeah. And with a brown butter. You know, that's the interesting thing too, is that you try to change your menu up seasonally, but then you have such good food on your menu that nobody wants you to change what's on there. Uh, listen, I've gotten used to that over the years. No matter no matter what you serve, no matter how great it is, people are, uh, even even a dish that I, you know may not be doing great, somebody's always gonna love it. Yeah. And you just have to sort of believe in yourself that what you're gonna bring, bring to the table uh, next is gonna be great. One thing that I've noticed has been like exploding over the last couple of years, charcuterie boards. So what, how did you start to piece this together? Uh, this is um, just a, an offering of all things great. It's literally <laughs> called the chef's never board board. Uh, and it rotates depending on also a huge part of seasonality. And a lot of, a lot of our rotation comes from when I get bored mm -hmm. uh, and I just wanna change stuff up which is something that most restaurants can't do. Yeah, so I, I get away that. with that. Definitely unique with Allegory. When you were trying to find a place for your restaurant, why did you choose downtown Naperville? Because Naperville's great. Naperville is great. Obviously we know that. Huge, huge community support. Mm -hmm. uh, it has a great collection of other uh, retail and dining and built-in foot traffic and the best community support I think I've seen in a community. Honestly, everybody loves uh, are all about shop local, shop small. Mm -hmm. They support me. I have like 83% of my customers are repeat. That's unheard of in the industry. Mm -hmm. That's pretty, I'm pretty proud of that. Nice. Well, Chris Mason, the owner of Allegory, we're going to eat. We're going to have some uh, things to drink. Thanks for joining us. Thanks for having me. I'm Danielle Tafano with another episode of Around Downtown. Thanks for joining us.